Welcome to Reading Africa. Today we're going to read about the Kingdom of Lunda. The Kingdom of Lunda was a confederation of states in what is now the Democratic Republic of Congo, northeastern Angola, and northwestern Zambia. Its central state was in Katanga. The Kingdom of Lunda was established in 1600 and de established in 1887. Its government was a monarchy. Initially, the core of what would become the Lunda Confederation was a commune called the Nganye in the Kilunda language. It was ruled by a monarch called Mwane Ayanga. One of these rulers, Ilunga Chibida, came from the nation of Lumba, where his brother ruled and married a royal woman from the nation to their south. Their son became the first paramount ruler of the Lunda, creating the title of Mwana Ayamvu in 1665. The Lunda kingdom controlled some 150,000 kilometers square by 1680. The state doubled in size. At its height in the 19th century, it was about 300,000 kilometers square. The Mwana Ayamvu of Lunda became powerful militarily from their base of 175,000 inhabitants. Along with this military strength through sheer numbers, the Lunda Kingdom also received Muslim military advisors and some dated weapons from the cities of Nyangwe and Kaba Mbare. Through marriage with the descendants of the Lumba kings, they gained political ties. The Lunda people were able to settle and colonize other areas and tribes, thus extending their kingdom through southwest Katanga into Angola and northwestern Zambia and eastwards across Katanga into what is now Luapula, province of Zambia. The kingdom became a confederation of a number of chieftainships that enjoyed a degree of local autonomy as long as tributes were paid with Mwata Yamvu as paramount ruler and a ruling council to assist with his administration. The strength of the kingdom enabled it to conquer territories of other tribes, especially to the east. In the 18th century, a number of migrations took place as far as the region to the south of Lake Tanganyika. The Bemba people of northern Zambia descended from the Luba migrants who arrived in Zambia throughout the 17th century. At the same time, a Lunda chief and warrior called Mwata Kazembe set up an eastern Lunda kingdom in the valley of Lopula River. The collapse of the Lunda came in the 19th century when it was invaded by the Chokwe, who were armed with guns. The Chokwe then established their own kingdom with their languages and custom. Lunda chiefs and people continued to live in Lunda Hutland, but were diminished in power. At the start of the colonial era in 1884, the Lunda Hutland was divided between Portuguese, Angola, King Leopold II of Belgium's Congo Free State, and the British in the northwestern Rhodesia, which became Angola, DR Congo, and Zambia, respectively. The Lunda groups in northern Rhodesia were led by two prominent chiefs, Ishindi and Kazembe Kazembe, with Ishindi establishing his kingdom in the northwestern of the country and Kazembe in the northeast. Of the two prominent chiefs, Ishindi was the firstborn of Mwanta Yamvu, which Kazembe was made king as a result of the reward for his loyalty to Mwanta Yamvu. This is the end of the Kingdom of Lunda. Please don't forget to like. Thank you.